Welcome back. Well, today we answer the age-old question asked by many pizziolas out there, what's the best flour for making pizza? And we approached it in a scientific way with our partners from Panhandle Milling, and we also used a very expensive import flour from Italy that many of you pizziolas are familiar with. And guys, I tell you what, this has been a very exciting day because many were really surprised by the outcome and really one of many blind tests yet to come. So Stephanie, tell us a little bit how we got to this point. So we very scientifically approached this. The dough had the, all, all of them had the exact same hydrations, this, the exact same weight on all of the ingredients, and then they were all fermented for the exact same amount of time. Each dough ball was the exact same size, the exact same scaling. So there was, everything had a controlled environment to that. And then we actually had one pizziola be the one that cooked every single pizza so there was no variation with the style of how that crust was made and he was he was a very seasoned pizza maker so it was very very controlled as far as, far as that testing was concerned we wanted it to be a very scientific approach to that and it really was you know we recorded some of that process and uh, in fact uh, award-winning Chef Tommy Garnick yes. was involved with you in the kitchen preparing those pizza dough balls and Pat the results were really amazing, weren't they? They were truly amazing. <laughs> you know, we, we judged based on uh, structure, color, uh, aroma, and of course, taste. Yes, yes. And uh, as I said, uh, the results were uh, an eye-opener. <laughs> <laughs> they were. That imported Italian flour that's very expensive, I thought would finish either first or second. It really finished last. And uh, the top finish of the day was a high-gluten pizza. Is that right? Right. That's our high-gluten. It's a high-gluten flour that Panhandle Milling makes. It's used for bread, and it's also used for pizza. It's one that we use at every Woodfire University. So this, it was really cool to see that that absolutely was the best choice for pizza. You know, it, it handled the 900 degree heat, it handled perfect coloring and structure of the dough, and the taste was off the charts as well. That is correct, and what really impressed me is that, that it, it's about roughly half the price of that imported pizza flour from Italy. Well, you know, when you're looking at that bottom line, a lot of antennas went up out there saying, you know what, I can have better taste, for my customers and save on the bottom line, that's a huge deal, isn't it, Pat? That is huge. And the other thing that's huge about it, those are flowers that are made here in the U.S. from wheat grown here in the U.S., not overseas. Yes. And, you know, all of this uh, culminated because of the fact that we've been looking at different flowers for many years. Panhandle Milling has many options now for bakers, pizziolas, um, tortilla makers, etc. But this is really going to give uh, pizza companies out there another option, taste and money. Now, separate from that, we also had the same pizziola who cooked the test pizzas. He cooked up a new formulation that you have specifically for pizzas. And in my opinion, that was my favorite. And it ranked high on everything, structure, taste, color, aroma. Absolutely. So that was developed by our world-known food scientist, Beth Elizabeth Arndt. And it's just, it's got just the right structure. It's got a combination of a finer ground flour and then one that's a little coarser ground. It's a, it's a, a hybrid, if you, if you will. And it's just unique and beautiful. And the structure is amazing and it just gets crisp, but it also hydrates just perfect for that, that high heat to where it just... It comes out amazing. I love the flavor. I love everything about it. Well, I tell you, it was great taste. It was amazing. And Pat, I have to believe after today, and this is just one of many blind tests that you're going to be doing, but I have to believe that you're the next best friend of Pizziola out there, giving them options, better taste, and also helping them with that saving their dollar on the bottom line. Absolutely, Bill. We're very <laughs> proud of the Our Flowers. And with that said, right now, I know you have to have the attention. All of our viewers out there, what's the best way for them to learn more about Panhandle Milling Flowers? That would be panhandlemilling.com. You can get information on all our flowers, including our new pizza flower, on our website. Well, guys, very exciting day. Thank you so much. Stephanie, Pat, thanks for being on. Appreciate it.